Dave Miller joining me back here in the paddock. Dave, I want to talk real quick about Shears Hanover, a horse who won very nicely again for you. Back-to-back uh, -back wins. Now, kind of walked up top a little slower tempo on the engine, and he didn't really have to ask this one in the stretch. Um, no, he he, uh, he got out there good. Uh, got Yannick in front of me and um, moved him back, and he relaxed real well and uh, got an easy middle half. And, uh, yeah, he, he was pretty pretty strong finishing. Certainly looked good to me, two in a row. Now, a horse that always looks good to me, but keeps running into buzz saws is Tom Horn. You have that one in race 12. Tell me about last week when he nearly uh, reeled in Manolette. Well, I, I, I can say this because I own part of him. He will not pass a horse. It, he loves being second, third. I put him on the front. He lets one go by. You know, I mean, he just likes camera shy, I guess. Well, someday I hope you get your, your picture taken in the winner's circle with Tom Horn. Could be tonight. Uh, another one you got, Montserrat, really made a statement uh, last week with that six-length victory. Not the world's fastest race, but seems like a horse on the improve to me. Yeah, I, I picked him up there. Well, I got to drive him a few times in Kentucky, and uh, I liked him a lot. And then he came here and uh, uh, raced really well in the elimination of the Breeders' Crown. Um, then he drew in a race, and he, he won pretty handy last week. I was re really impressed with him. Do you think we could see a repeat effort? Did he have more in the tank, or was he kind of all out? No, he actually went pretty handy there. Um, yeah, I, I think he can repeat. Certainly hope so, Dave. Thanks for your time. Yep, my pleasure.